Well, hello, everybody. Happy Monday to you. And it is time for daily prayer. And I don't know if you were able to do it, but we sent out early this morning and we posted on our websites a brand new prayer that we wrote that is pertinent for this time Mm -hmm. with everything going on with the coronavirus and so many people uh, realizing that they're testing positive for this virus. Uh, Yes, we have a scriptural prayer of protection, but this is a scriptural prayer for healing because God is a healing Mm -hmm. God. And so we want to pray this prayer And so I'll have Kimberly greet us. But if you can, if you haven't already done it, download that. You can either do it through one of the emails that we sent out if you're on the email list. But you can go to solidlives.com, solidlives.com, and you'll find it there on the landing page. You can also go to gototherock.com, and you'll find it on the landing page there. Well, it's good to be able to pray with you this morning. And we believe that as we pray Because we're praying God's will, He hears us. And because we know He hears us, there can be an assurance that we have the petitions that we ask of Him today. Well, you know, prayer, you can spend hours and hours in prayer and still not get it all done. It's not boring when you realize that God answers prayer. You realize, oh man, I'm not wasting time. I'm getting things done. Right. So I'm going to go off of this. Now, I presume that some of you may not have this in front of you, but I want to read the scriptures and then the short prayer that's after them, but then we'll pray together, okay? So uh, let's begin to lift up blessing to the Lord. You know, the Bible says, I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart. Mm -hmm. I will enter his courts with praise. Praise. And so, Lord, we enter your gates with thanksgiving. We We come into your courts with praise. We're thankful to you. We bless your your name for you You are are good. Praise your name, Lord. We speak praises to you. And we say, glory, uh, glorified is your name. Hallelujah. Bless you, Lord Jesus. And Lord, we come now in our time. We bless our nation. Uh, We bless our president, our our congressmen, our uh, governors, our mayors. Lord, everyone who is in between all of these leaders of our country, Lord, we bless them. Lead them all to you. Draw them all close to yourself. Use the current situations to bring them to yourself in Jesus' name. And Lord, bring America back to you. Bring America back to you. We declare this to be one nation under God, indivisible, Mm -hmm. with liberty and justice for for all. Now, Lord, we pray for all of your people that you protect them from all sicknesses, diseases, disasters, including the coronavirus. And Lord, those that have already been infected, and especially those of your people, Mm -hmm. Lord, we want to pray. And so, Lord, we pray for ourselves. Anybody needing healing today, we're praying this over you as well. Mm -hmm. But Lord, we start off with your word because your will is what we need to pray. And we know that your word Mm -hmm. declares and explains your will. Mm -hmm. So according Mm -hmm. to your word, Father, your word says in Proverbs 4, 20 to 22, my son, be attentive to my words. Incline your ear to my sayings. Let them not escape from your sight. Keep them within your heart, for they are life to those who find them and healing to all their flesh. My son, be attentive to my words because they are healing to all your flesh. So I am choosing now to be attentive to your words and to incline my ear to your sayings. I will not let them escape from my sight. I will keep them within my heart for your words words are life to me because I have found them and they are healing healing to to all all my my flesh. flesh. So let's declare that. And you, if you would, just lift up your voice. I don't know exactly where you are, but uh, however you're able to do it. Share your uh, words with the Lord. Let's declare, Lord, we thank you that your word, the Bible, it is healing to all of our flesh. From the top of our heads to the bottom of our feet. We thank you for complete healing and wholeness in Jesus' name. Lord, we pray over people that have contracted the coronavirus. Oh, we speak 
your word to their flesh. Yes. Be healed be in the name healed, of Jesus. Jesus. Be healed. Be healed. And Lord, your word Thank says in Proverbs 18, 21, and also in Proverbs 12, 18, the tongue has the power of life and death, and the tongue of the wise brings healing. <laughs> so Lord, because your word says yes. that, I choose to I use choose. the power of my yes. tongue to speak life and, speak not life and not death. I choose to speak your words and healing to my body. So I speak healing. Yes. I speak life to my body. I speak healing to my let's body in Jesus' name. Let's, let's speak those two things. I speak life and I speak healing. I speak life to my I body and I speak body. healing I speak to my healing body to my in body. the name of in Jesus. Jesus name. And Lord, those in that are Jesus sick around name. us, people that we know that are sick, maybe a family yes. member or a friend or a co-worker that we heard about, in the name of Jesus, let's call their name. Lord, whoever they are, we call their name right now. And we say, be healed, be healed. in Jesus' name. Be healed. Lord, for be those healed. that are partnering with us today in prayer, anyone sick there, oh, we speak life yes, to them in Jesus' name. I speak life to you. I speak healing to you yes. in the name of Jesus. I speak healing to your physical body in Jesus', in name. Jesus name. Be healed. Bones, ligaments, mm -hmm. heart, arteries, lungs, 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 be healed be in healed. the name of Jesus. Stomach, be healed in Jesus' name. Kidneys, you, liver, Lord. pancreas, be healed in Thank Jesus' you, name. Throat, be healed. Eyes, be healed. Teeth, be healed. Ears, be opened and healed yes, in Jesus' name. In Jesus Skin, name. be healed and cleansed, cleansed. in the mm -hmm. name of Jesus Praise you, God. We thank you, Lord, from the top thank of their head you, to the Lord. bottom of their feet. We speak life to them, and we speak healing to them yes, in the name of Jesus. Honey, take this next one, would you? In Exodus 15, 26, it says, If you will diligently listen to the voice of the Lord your God, and do that yes. which is right in his eyes, and you give ear to his, his commandments, commandments and, and keep, keep all, all his statutes, statutes I will, I will put none, none of the diseases on you that I put on the Egyptians, Egyptians for I am the Lord, your, your healer. healer. <laughs> so, though I am saved by grace and not, not by the works of the law, I choose, choose to diligently listen to your voice and do, do what is right in your eyes. eyes. It, it is my joy to obey your commandments, commandments and, and I thank you, my Father, father that, that you will not put the diseases on me for you, you are, are the Lord, Lord my, my healer. healer. So let's God. receive that right now and Amen. declare Jesus, you're our healer. You, you are, are our healer. Lord oh, and Jesus. you're our healer. You Come on, proclaim that. You are our Lord. You are our Lord. And you are our, and healer. You are our healer. Thank you that you put Glory none of those God. diseases on us. Amen. For you're our God. And yes, we give you, you are. thanks. You are our God and our healer. God's Praise word also God. says in Exodus 23, 25, he will bless your, your bread and, and water, water and, and I will take sickness away from, from the midst of you. Thank, Thank you, Lord, Lord that, that you bless my bread and my water, all of my food, and that you take all sickness away from the midst of me, even God. over every meal. That's right. I encourage you to pray this. That's right. Let's pray this. Father, thank you that you bless thank our bread you, Lord, that you bless our and, bread and our water, water, and you take, you take sickness, sickness from, the midst, from the midst of us. Thank you. We receive Praise that God. in we Jesus' name. We receive it in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And Lord, your word says in Deuteronomy 7, 15, and the Lord will take away from you all sickness. All sickness. Oh, I'm going to declare that over yeah. you today. And the Lord will take away from you all, all sickness. sickness. And will afflict you with none of the terrible diseases of Egypt. So, Lord, I give you thanks and yes. praise that you take you away from me all, all sickness, sickness and that you will not afflict me with any diseases. Amen. And now, Lord, I pray for those who are partnering with us, watching yes. today, praying with us, 
Lord, I thank thank you and praise you that you take away from them all sickness, all sickness and you will not afflict them with any, any diseases. diseases. Glory thank to you God. It, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank take you. it away from them. Yes. Take it away. You said, and the Lord will take it away. He I will. thank you, Lord, for taking it away thank in you, Jesus' we name. We give you thanks for take it. Take that one. Psalm 34, 19 says, Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but, but the Lord, Lord delivers, delivers him out of them all. all. Therefore, afflictions, afflictions do not disqualify me from being the righteousness of God in Christ. And I, I declare, declare that no matter what afflictions may come, you promise to deliver me out of them all. all. So you may be in the middle of afflictions mm-hmm. right now. Well, But the Lord, through his word, says he will deliver you out of them all. So in Jesus' name, name receive delivery from every affliction. Because the faithful one says, I will deliver you from them all. And we give you thanks. We give you thanks, Lord. Yes, we We do. We give you thanks. Psalm 103, 2 and 3 says, Bless the Lord, O O my my soul, soul, and and forget forget not all his benefits, benefits, who forgives all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases. So I choose to bless you from the depths of my soul, and I will not forget all your benefits. You forgive all my iniquities, and you heal all my diseases. So right now where you are, receive that forgiveness and say, Lord, thank you. That you you forgive me for all my iniquities. iniquities. There is no iniquity that we confess that you hold on to, but you forgive us from them all. Thank you, Jesus. And Lord, we remember today your benefit too. Yes, we do. You heal all All our diseases. diseases. Go ahead and let them know. Oh, Oh, you heal all our diseases. So we give you thanks. It's who you are. We remember who you are. We we remember your benefits today. And we give you thanks. And Lord, we thank you for healing our loved ones. Yes. Oh, we thank you. You want to heal their diseases as well. Lord, encourage them to look to you, to open their hearts, to call on you, and to make you their God and healer in Jesus' name. And Lord, your word says in Psalm 107, verse 20, he sent his word Mm -hmm. and healed them. And and deliver them them. from their destructions. So I thank you, Lord, that because of your love and willingness to heal, you You sent sent your your word to me with with healing healing promises. promises. And your word is so powerful that it both heals me and And delivers delivers me. me. (laughs) Praise God. So, Lord, we thank you. In fact, thank him with us. Would we you say, you, Lord, Lord, I thank you that your word was sent to thank heal you me. for your word. <laughs> you sent me. your word. You know you what comes to mind is when the Lord says in Isaiah 55, 11, so shall my word be that goes forth from my mouth. It shall not return to me mm. void, but shall accomplish what I please and prosper in the mm. thing for which I sent it. Well, in this case, mm. he sent his word and healed them. And the Lord says, thank not going to return to me That's void. Right. It's going to get the job done and heal you. So in Jesus' name, we send the word of healing to you. We send the word of healing to you in the name of Jesus. Be Be healed. You be healed. Be healed in In Jesus' Jesus name. name. Praise God. Thank Thank you, you, Lord Lord Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Well, let's see. We're uh, we've got a few more to go. So I tell you what we'll do. Let's just close in prayer right now. Mm -hmm. And what we'll do is we'll come back tomorrow and we'll pray the rest of this prayer. Does that sound good? So, Lord, we thank you for our time together. Thank you. (laughs) Lord, talking with you, rehearsing your word, declaring the truth of your word. Oh, Mm -hmm. it's not a waste of time. No, it's not. And it warrants much, much more time than we've allotted in this session. But, Lord, I pray that you would help those that are partnering with us in prayer to continue to pray. As the Bible says, pray without ceasing. And, Lord, answer their prayers. Show yourself strong on their behalf. In the name of Jesus, we we pray. Amen. 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 Well, we love you, and uh, we look forward to being with you tomorrow for daily prayer.